If we could launch the apple into space, the pull of the Earth's gravity would grow smaller and smaller as the apple moves farther and farther away. When an object like this apple isn't moving, we say it is at rest. It will stay at rest until a force makes it move. This property in objects is called inertia. Inertia means an object at rest tends to stay at rest. An object that is moving tends to keep moving. Because of the force of gravity between the Earth and this ball, the force of gravity can start objects moving, change the direction of moving objects, and stop objects that are already moving. Because of inertia, we've got to exert a force on an object to get it to move or change its speed, change its direction, or stop it. If I force the napkin to move by pulling it, Because of inertia, the books tend to stay at rest. Inertia also tells us that an object in motion has a tendency to stay in motion. I'm going to run across the lawn and try and stop at that yellow rope over there. My feet stopped, but my body kept going past the mark because of inertia. Things in motion have a tendency to stay in motion. Things at rest have a tendency to stay at rest. The amount of inertia in an object never changes unless the amount of mass or material in it changes.